Hi Shoebox friends, this is Denise from D. Rogers. Thanks for joining me for another unboxing. This is for a boy two to four. I think we only have about 31 days until National Collection Week. So it's getting close and it's getting exciting. So let's take a look at this box for our sweet little boy two to four. It is fun on the farm. His box is decorated with these little um, pictures of farm animals. There's a pig. Um, rooster or hen and a sheep on that side and on the top is a goose those were just printables I found online and actually I attached them to a piece of cardstock so he can slide them right out and use them to play with when he opens his box it, it's covered and lined with this red bandana so when he opens his box this is what he'll see. And right on top is this cute little, um, they're called Squishmallows. I got this one at Walmart before Easter because I knew it probably wouldn't be there after Easter. Uh, it's a cute little, I guess it's a hen or a rooster. It doesn't have a name, but these are just so soft and so squishy and lovable. I love them. I've used them in quite a few boxes. He has a, a drawstring bag that I made for him and it has farm animals all over it. And when he opens it up, he has some farm play toys. I'll just dump them all out. So he has in here a little set from um, Jadori. It is a uh, like a tractor pull. There is a farmer. get him to stand up. There's a little lamb and a little dog. And then these are the uh, wooden blocks, nice quality, that a lot of people found from Walgreens after Christmas. Let's see if I can put it together. So this is a cow. This is a pig. This is a sheep, little fence, oops, there we go, and a little rooster sit on top. Those are really nice quality. Um, I got them very inexpensive. Um, I think it was, it's either after Easter or after Christmas, I can't remember. It might have been, I think, after Easter. So um, that makes a cute little set, and then he has something to put his toys in when he's done playing. Okay, he has a coloring book. It's called My Fun Day on the Farm. It's really cute. It has stickers, nice big stickers on the front. And the pages are nice and big for a little boy this age. Okay, he has a lovey in here. I made this lovey. It is a um, just a little snuggle blanket that I got the material from Joanne Fabrics and just did a running stitch on the side. And as you can see, it's got farm animals all over it. And I folded it up pretty nicely so it fit pretty good right on the side of this box. But this will be nice for him to cuddle and actually you can use it to play on top of. This was actually um, a little bit bigger than what I normally do. He has soap with nail clippers and a nail file inside. He has a sippy cup. I ordered this one from Amazon and inside the sippy cup he has a little pig that is a bag. It's like a little drawstring bag, carry bag. So he has something to carry his things home in. And he has two erasers for school. Okay, all of his school supplies are kind of loosely tucked in here. I might be pulling them out a little bit at a time. He has a marker. He has some novelty pencils. He has a um, click pen with a multi pen with different colors in there. He has a pencil sharpener. 
And inside his pencil sharpener, I tucked this little cross necklace from Oriental Trading. Let's see if I can get it back in. Okay, he has a puzzle. This is from Dollar Tree. It's called Fun on the Farm. I really like these because they're, um, it's a reusable bag that he can put the puzzle pieces back into. He has a comb. Okay, he has this really nice book. It's called Touch and Feel Farm. And on each one is a farm animal and it's really cute. When he touches the little fur, this says, feel the soft fluffy chicks. Pet the velvety smooth horse. Tickle the shepherd dog's furry tummy. These are great, I love these books. And this could be a good learning tool if he doesn't know English. He could pick up a few words, um, but I think you'll have fun with the pictures and the ability to touch and feel. He has two pairs of underwear. These are a size four, size four. One is Ryan's World and one is Paw Patrol. He has some jumbo crayons for his coloring book. He has a couple of trucks and cars. So he has two farm trucks. And they're kind of cute. This one has a rooster on the side of it. Um, this one's called Mighty Max. I don't know, it just looked like a farm truck to me. And this is the tractor. So those were fun to add. He has a spoon. He has a kaleidoscope, a little farm kaleidoscope with farm animals on it. I got that at Easter. He has a fork. These are all from Ikea. And a butter knife. These are, again, Ikea. And he has a cute little outfit. This red striped shirt just reminded me of a little boy on the farm. This was from Walmart. And I think I got it for a dollar on clearance. Okay, he has a pair of nice little stretch pants. These are nice because they have the little stretchy band at the top. This is a 5T. Oh, and the shirt's a 5T also. These are Granimals. And I think I got this for one or two dollars at Walmart. Okay, he has a toothbrush with the cover on it. Here's all of his sharpened pencils and some click pens. And I just attached a little tissue on top. He has a really soft blue washcloth with the scalloped edges. I ordered that on Amazon. He has a cute little pair of socks to match his outfit in the red and black colors. There's a composition book, a half composition book. I get these from Walmart. He has a little wash puppet mitt that I got from the Dollar Tree and it's a cow. So I think he could have fun playing with that and washing with it. Here's his pencil case at the bottom. That's from Amazon. He has a cute little felt play set sounds of the barnyard. I attach some Velcro to it to keep everything inside and it comes with little characters. It's really cute. I got this from the dollar spot from Target. Oh, I don't want to open it up because it's sealed. But inside he, it has like a tractor, a farmer, a pig, some hay, so he can have some um, felt fun play time. And the, you can reverse the farm like this. That's really cute. I think I actually got that for 30 cents on clearance from the dollar spot. Okay, he has a blank little book. I put a little chick and barn sticker on the front. This is a great place for his stickers or just to draw and color on. And inside he has these nice big stickers. 
different characters. That's a goose and a bee and a frog and a bunny rabbit and a sheep. And these are actually from a big coloring book from the Dollar Tree. And I just liked the size of those stickers. Okay, he has our, a note from us and our picture to a special boy. And then of course he has his cute little bandana because he will need his bandana on the farm. Oh, and there's more underneath. More stickers, some farm animals, some more farm animals. And, ah, this is a Melissa and Doug set of stickers. More farm animals. So I think he's got a good amount of stickers to play with. And that uh, completes my box for a boy two to four, fun on the farm. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope your packing's going great. Thanks again for coming back and watching. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. So have a blessed day and I'll see you in my next unboxing. Bye-bye.